Uh, first things first, uh, anyone seeing this in the future, please don't use this for like my wake or like a wedding. <laughs> All of this is new stuff. Don't, don't make this part of like a clip show of me. Uh, <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm single and I'm actually, I'm, I'm doing it right. Uh, Cause uh, I don't know what it is about me being like an adult, but like I'm, I'm suddenly good at dating now. Uh, like, uh, like uh, I was very much a late bloomer. I came into boobs very late in life. And, uh, like, the, uh, you know, things things are working out for me. You know, things are going good. I'm seeing it all the time. I'm like George O'Keefe that way. I'm wow. Okay, not a great art history reference. All right. Uh, uh, <laughs> I was thinking more Pollock. Really? Like. I'm not, I feel like you and me are looking at different stuff, buddy. Okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, is anybody in the crowd like a, a Lyft driver or like an Uber driver? <sighs> Big Will was here, but you know, that's, you know, that's totally fine because I don't want to have pointless small talk for, for, like the, for like the next 15 minutes. I don't know what that is. It feels like, it, it, it feels like I'm having like a, like a social gun to my head every time I order a car. And it's always the same stuff, like, where are you from? Where are you going? Also, how do I get to where you're going? <laughs> Which feels very odd, you know? I, or, I, I, uh, I, I, I ordered a lift, you know? Not like chicken soup of the, like, some cabby soul. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that was a little mean, but I mean, yeah. yeah. Like, I, I, I make sure to tip afterwards. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that was a poor story joke, at least. Anyway, um, I recently came back from uh, pretty pretty startling news. My first, my first, my first cancer scare. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It was uh, it was about like three months ago. I ended up finding a lump where there shouldn't have been one. It was like right in my like my groin area. And I, uh, when you when you're when you're when you're at a certain age and you find like a lump like that, you, and you're a guy, you immediately think, oh, all right. Like, you know, lefty, he decided to jump up for a bit, you know? Like, uh, yeah, like it's always a very odd feeling when one of your, like, organs decides to, like, gentrify an area. Like, 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 you don't belong there. Like, just, come on, you're ruining the, you're ruining the area. But, uh, no, no, it's definitely, uh, it was definitely warm enough that it was not one of them. And, um, and I was immediately terrified. Yeah, so I went to the went to the hospital and I got it checked out. And I don't know the last time anyone here has been to the hospital or like seen a medical professional, but they're very quippy now. Like they're very like casual and like uh, like shooting like shooting from the hip. So I I see like I speak to my doctor and I'm like yeah yada 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 like I'm sure it's just like a hernia or like a weird like I already used the fucking gentrified joke either way. And uh, <laughs> like uh, she's a she looks at me, she's like, yeah, it could be any of those things, you know? It could be like this or that or this or that or cancer. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm like, no, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> you, you, you can't generalize with cancer. And uh, she immediately stops and she goes, yeah, it might be cancer. I don't know what this is. Uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> So essentially after that, she gives me a referral to see a specialist. And for like three weeks, I immediately imagine that I have cancer. And the first thing that goes through your mind when you think you have cancer is that you don't deserve cancer, other people deserve cancer. <laughs> <laughs> if you laughed at that joke, you deserve cancer more than me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, like there's just like, there's, 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 a, there's a slew of other people out there who deserve cancer more than me. Uh, uh, politicians, uh, Hitler aficionados, um, <laughs> Trump, Trump, yeah, I said Hitler aficionados, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Nazis are, or even Nazis are essentially just like bougie Klansmen, but still, like, you, like, uh, I, 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 that qualifies. So, um, for, <laughs> I, uh, I go see this, I go see the uh, specialist that I was referred to, and for my first ultrasound, so for, for the ultrasound, uh, it's, it's essentially everything you've seen in television for like babies, but like if, if it's for like possibly cancer, they, like, they just put it on a separate part of the body. And for me, it was right where like your hip turns into fun, you know what I mean? <laughs> so like the, like the woman, she said, like, yeah, like, it, uh, like this woman, she said, she's like, all right, just take off your pants and you know, we're gonna put some cream on it 
uh, sorry, it's a gel. We're gonna put some gel on it, and then this note, and we're gonna be totally fine. And I'm like, great, no problem. And as like a courtesy, she gives me a towel. And I and I'm immediately put at ease, you know? Because like I wasn't I wasn't ready for a show, so to speak. Um, and like she immediately gets started, and almost almost immediately Almost like as soon as she turns on the machine, she goes, "Oh wait, the doctor's in." And this like old man and this other guy come into the room, and then they get started working on the machine. And uh, my doctor he introduces himself like, "Hi, I'm Dr. Richards. It's a pleasure to meet you. I uh, I hear I hear we're worried it's cancer. It's probably not. You're a pretty young guy." <laughs> All right. Hey, this is Bobby, by the way. <laughs> Bobby's my intern. Is this okay? And like. Bobby was around my age, and I didn't want to be like the guy that was like not helping out. So I was like, yeah, all right, it's like, uh, it's, like it's, it's, like, it's cancer between the two of us. And um, so Dr. Richards, I don't know how long he's been working, but he's got to be, he must have been working for a really long time. Because with gusto, he takes my, takes this cloth off and he goes, fuck! And immediately I'm presented to the world. <laughs> like so, it's me, Dr. Richards, Bobby, and some, and the original uh, uh, specialist who is there. And um, there's always like this very odd moment when like men see each, like when when you when your penis is in front of another man. Like even in a sexual sense, it's always kind of silly. Like you know, like, <laughs> like the penis is like the it, it's like <laughs> it, 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 it like is a form of genitalia. It's just goofy. <laughs> it has no, it has no sense like of, like we're supposed to be, and like I don't know why, but for me, like whenever like my penis is out, like I have this like very like broy like internal monologue that goes out, like ah, look at us, <laughs> look at look at where life is taking us, you know? like for you it was a Monday, for me it was this, ah, so he's poking around and. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, the doctor? No. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Richards is just like poking around. He's just making like uh, he's, he's inspecting my lymph nodes for uh, cancer, and uh, it's taking like a really long time. And every once in, like every couple of minutes, he's just like popping back to Bobby just to make sure he's like, all right. So I'm seeing six infected lymph nodes. You can see that, Bobby? Like, yeah, I got it. And yep, right around the corner. That's a cell. Seventh lymph node. See that, Bob? See that? Yeah, I got it. And it was maybe around like the ninth lymph node that I realized that Bobby was also a doctor. <laughs> so Doctor Richard wasn't like he wasn't teaching him anything new. He was just being a dick in front of this guy <laughs> while my dick was out. <laughs> and, um, and like I, 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 we ended up finishing. He ended up like uh, handing, like throwing the towel back at me like I was dirty or something. And he was like, "All right, we'll get your test results in a couple of days or two." And uh, I remember just think, thinking about the rest of that day, going like, man, like it is Monday, the Pope's weekend, and Bobby just immediately saw everything as a, like, because he, not because he had to, because he was learning, but because he just happened to be around Dr. Richards at that time. And like, just, so, like, I don't know who that, I don't even know who that guy is, he's just walking around, like, man, I got with cancer, who might have cancer, is also circumcised. Very strange world. <laughs> <laughs> it's new material. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's gonna get watered down. Uh, yeah. Uh, God, so what else is new? So did you get your results? Oh! Wait a second. I wanted to. Yes. Uh, <laughs> they don't know. <laughs> I know. I, I wish I knew too. In fact, I wish I knew more for like not comedy reasons than comedy reasons. <laughs> Uh, like this, I know this bit doesn't end well, but like that's how I feel about my life. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I feel it. Uh, so I'm doing a lot of reading. <laughs> Damn it! All right. Thank you so much.